New totals for unemployment claims have been released, and once again, the numbers are increasing at a staggering rate. It shows one out of every five Americans has sought jobless uh, aid since mid-March. Eyewitness News reporter Logan Wilbur has the latest on the claims and the outlook for Rhode Island. It's an unfortunate metaphor for Rhode Island's economy. The Hasbro Cube has stopped spinning and countless Rhode Islanders are left without work. As the state prepares to begin reopening the economy, it's also bracing for the latest wave of unemployment numbers. As Rhode Island begins its path to economic recovery, one economist says it's a longer road than many expect. Fewer Rhode Islanders were employed as of just a few months ago, and certainly it still persists, than 2006. April's unemployment numbers from the Bureau of Labor Statistics will be released Friday morning. However, newly released data shows 3.1 million Americans filed unemployment claims in the past week, raising the total to 33 million since the COVID-19 pandemic pulled the rug out from the economy. At that time, Rhode Island's unemployment rate was 4.6 percent, equal to the 15th highest rate in the country. Dr. Ladaro says the ocean state is likely heading to uncharted waters. The unemployment rate for Rhode Island, uh, sadly, I think could easily hit 20 percent. Rhode Island is highly dependent on the industries most adversely affected, hospitality, tourism, travel. Thankfully, there is a life preserver in these times. While thousands of Rhode Islanders wait for financial assistance and wonder how to pay for rent and food, a local senior center is expanding its food pantry to offer services to all of those in need. They come and they can get food or we can also provide other resources that are out in the community for them. And this is a hard, hard time, difficult time for many of our families out there. It is a difficult time for many families, and I want to put into perspective just what 33 million Americans looks like. It's more than 3 million people more than the population of Texas. It's more than the combined population of Georgia, Ohio, and Michigan. It's also 31 times the population of Rhode Island. Reporting in Providence, Logan Wilbur, Eyewitness News.